In this channel, we have a tradition where I suit up for the season finale, but still no pants. And you know why? You should know by now, because this is a hobby, not a job. Let's begin. Okay, Gunslinger versus Dragon Android Girl. Let's go. A nuke. A nuke her. Nuke her! Here it is. Here's a nuke. And this is the Dark God's sister? Or is it nuke? I don't know. Because that thing at the outside, that's the Dark God's sister, right? The consultant still got a plan. Or maybe he's gonna die right now. Bro did not have a plan. Bro definitely did not have a plan for that. What's the point of your skills if you can't fucking predict this, bro? <laughs> okay, I think that was a nuke from the gunslinger, right? It had to be, right? This is 60% of your entire body. Okay, so this is the units again. So this is the uh, android girl. So the medical units talk, and I'm sure she's gonna get fucking fixed up, bro. She's a fucking android. Oh? Two options. Dragon heal, but surely there's a consequences, right? Irreversible change. Like what? You turn into a dragon. You fine with it? I, who shall awaken. <laughs> Are you supposed to go juggernaut drive? She's just gonna turn into a fucking dragon? <laughs> okay. You're next to a dragon now. Cool. She this is a wyvern. Again, wy wyvern is when you have the wings on your back and, and, the, and the arms, you know, the wings aren't attached to the fucking... Eh, whatever, wyvern dragon doesn't matter. Anyways, she turned into a fucking CGI wyvern, bro. She turned from an android cute waifu to a CGI wyvern. She should have fucking stayed the same, bro. Is it the same wyvern that killed her? The same, like, uh, model? Okay, Dark God Sister's womb? You should use your power any way you want. Shine. Okay, Ninja Samurai alive, and so is that fucking piece of shit. Nano machines? Second gate is killing the law of physics. What are these gates? It has to do with Alpha Omega and like, you know. He said the first gate opens, second gate opens, and like, what, maybe his powers are unlocking even more. Like, what, is, what else can he do? Such as one. Dragon Warrior. The teeth fall out? <laughs> they just straight up copy pasted every one of these. Uh, honestly, it's totally fine. It's totally fine with me. Damn. So, like, you lose your teeth and, like, you make, like, Dragon Warriors like this? Alright, alright. She can, like, create an army now. You know Hanako is gonna survive beyond this, man. You know he will. Yo, what are these? What the fuck am I watching, bro? This looks so... <laughs> the budget, where did it go? <laughs> yeah, it's a bunch of Shinozaki clones. All of you, Shine, done. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Amazing. <laughs> Well, honestly, like, if you're just gonna do this, it makes sense why they would, like, cheap out on the budget. It's like, fuck, are we gonna really spend that much money and time to animate these fucking, you know, copy-pasted clones that's just gonna die immediately? Oh, what, what is it? What's the phenomenon? Okay. Alpha Omega phase. How many phases are there, right? Like, is there a phase three we're gonna fucking get? Like... Okay. Recognition is blocked. We are created in the event that humanity has been... It's like a contingency plan. They're like this organization, whoever they are. I forget. There was like the Institute, the agency, and blah, blah, blah. But they were all kind of working on Alpha Omega. But the different like team exists to basically counter. It's like a safety measure against Alpha Omega. Not that that kind of makes sense. I thought you could ever do that. What's your name? Alpha Omega with liberated powers can't recognize us. Okay. <laughs> this is so bad. <laughs> no, I mean, I mean, we were, I mean, it's like, it's not too bad, but like, goddamn, it's like the finale. Like, what am I fucking watching right now, bro? <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know what are you here for. Tell me. Oh, what? Yes, it's the same wyvern model! Shine, and you're dead. Wow, who could have saw that coming? Still functioning. 
and the multiplicity of completely independent units. So even though this wyvern is dead through the shine, there's some like functioning parts. So it's not like a complete loss. Okay, so they, they can't, even though they took an L, it's not a complete L. So it's like progress for them. Oh, is it? <laughs> this guy's gonna live no matter what, man. Oh? Oh! Hello! They finally meet. Oh god, oh god, here we fuck. Is she gonna live? Is she gonna live this outcome? I don't know. Oh god. Hello, we finally meet. Hello? Oh, 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 oh. What the, what the, what the? What the? Did she subconsciously just like fall to her knees because of Yoki? What was that? I don't know either. Oh, okay, she ki okay, he did the partial killing. He killed the partial killing. That's what he was practicing. Oi, answer me. Shine. Oh, he's just toying with her, bro. By accident, he says. Put your hand down. Using an instant death technique to make my heart. She has instant death tech because there's a like difference between what Yogiri is doing and instant death magic. Huh. You would die before you even use it. Shine again. The fingers don't work? Kill more fingers? I allowed her to escape. She does just pour it in and out, huh? Okay, back to her like Castlevania castle. Oh! <laughs> but like, even if you heal it, I bet it wouldn't work. Cause like, you kill the concept of her fingers. What? Yeah. No. Never mind. That's work. So like, you can basically so like, you could do the same thing with the ankles. I thought it'd be like permanent or something. Let's, oh! Never mind. Long distance. Long distance. It is absurd. You are being unreasonable too. And Yoichi might be almost dead. Uh oh. What was that? Did he just kill his dick? Hands, feet. Oh, I'm sorry, Yoichi. I don't even I barely even know you. And she's dead. <laughs> so Yoichi's the only person that she really likes. Why? Just like a boy toy. In the opening, like she does like simp over Yoichi. He seems to be the only one. We don't really know much about Yoichi and them though, huh? Like it's pretty hinted that they're like lovers, but like why? This is actually terrifying. Wow, he just talks with like a calm tone. It is scary. You're gonna fucking live forever, Hanakawa. Hanakawa is literally gonna live, be immortal. Yeah. Is it the worst that he'll do? I don't know. I feel like you just jinxed it right there, ninja. Or sorry, samurai. Yeah, is this so hard? Just tell me how to go home. He did a different adventure in some shit before, right? A uh, link is gone now? Link start? Okay. How do we get Link back? Okay, she got the coordinates. That's a lot. Moku Moku will remember. I bet she will. I'm not gonna forget that you fucking betrayed me last episode, Moku Moku. Fuck you. Down there, still upset a little bit. <laughs> She's trying to be so useful. It's like, oh, I'm so useful. You need me. You need me. Okay, if we have the energy and the coordinates, we can go. Where's the energy from? The Philosopher's Stone. Have we ever heard this before? I don't think so. Okay, and we need multiple Philosopher's Stones. Oh, we should have extracted those. So, the stone loses... Like, because we killed him, like, the Philosopher's Stones are just all dead, too. We fucked up. We need more sages. We need more sages. Yogiri should join in on the sage recruitment program and try to get a bunch of people to become sages and, you know, farm the fucking stones out. Stone is a source of immortality for the sage. But that's not why Lane was immortal, right? Lane, Lane's powers. Because she just said the Philosopher's Stones is the source of immortality. I thought Lane was immortal, like, uniquely. But now she's basically implying that every sage has a Philosopher's Stone, and every sage pretty much is as immortal as Lane now, right? 
He's a pretty reasonable person if you're nice to him. Hanakawa, careful. She might kill you. No, she won't. Hanakawa's gonna live forever. You're gonna give her feedback or what? Yeah, what about Yoichi? What about Yoichi? Oh, what is that? Dark God Sisters menstrual fluids? Because, like, the birth of her son, brother. Oh, where's that? Where's that going? See, we're in her fucking womb still, bro. Ugh. <laughs> Just chops her legs off. <laughs> you did this shit. This is on you. Battle song? Battle song is a system? I'm not gonna feel bad for her, bro. Yogi's probably gonna come back and fucking kill the Dark God, though, right? Like, Yogi's just gonna be like, oh, Shine, you buy again. And then Shion's gonna be safe, right? Yeah, yeah. Battle song is a gift system? Gotcha. He'll come for you. Wow, she won't acknowledge us in that much, huh? I actually feel kind of bad for her all of a sudden. Just because of her, like, Yoichi and, like, her lover. Nah, she's like... She's fucking evil, dude. She's a fucking menace. Nah, remember everything that she's done? Nah, she's fucked in the head. Nah, I'm not gonna feel sorry, bro. I think it's because she's hot. I think it's, I'm being, like, softer because she's hot. It is what it is. Shine. Shine. Shion and, you know, Yoichi propaganda. Oh, what? They're holding hands? Isekai Village, copy-paste. What the fu- Aggressors? Aggressors? Oh, they're huge! What in the fuck is happening now? Aren't these like the angels from fucking Evangelion? Huh? No, that's the aggressor, that's the aggressor! Dark God, that's the Dark God. We know that. What the fuck is going on, though? Giga Chat Rick, he won't escape. Ooh, the Sword Master. Nah, it's not doing much. Yes. What the fuck? Oh, the guy from the... Remember when the um, the Divine King was like uh, tricked by the church, right? This is the guy. That, that was the church guy, right? <laughs> like, they showed this guy for like fucking 10 seconds and they just fucked off, dude. Like, how is anyone supposed to remember this shit? <laughs> uh, we're the main characters. Bye-bye. <laughs> Even Dick. I don't know. Connection to the Dark God, even though he's an Archbishop. What well, the connection is that now? Maybe! It would have been the cliche villain explaining. What did you say? Two different dialogue was happening at the same time. I'm starting to think Hanaka should take over the street man. Because <laughs> Dandora was pretty much the straight man role, right? It's like, Yogiri does something crazy, and there's gotta be like a straight man that's just like, WHAT THE FUCK? And Yogi's like, <laughs> Shine. So Hanaka was pretty much fulfilling that role now. Goodbye, Danora. You've been replaced. No, you are the waifu now. I mean, she's always been the waifu. Danora's the girlfriend, you know, the transition scene, they were holding hands. Breaking the fourth wall. The Dark God Sisters' menstrual fluids are overflowing, man. <laughs> I don't even blame him to be honest. It's not really his fault here. Dark Ghost is just fucking crazy. Shine. Danora is so calm about this. Hi, Takato Yogiri des. You piece of shit. You fucking piece of shit. Danura even was like, really, bro? Really? You're gonna sell him off that fucking quick? This fucking piece is just gonna continue onto the second season too, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> bro, come on. I wish she was just a little bit higher in frame, bro. Damn, she's fucking huge right now. Shine. No, you. Literally, no, you. Really? 
Could you not have at least given us a little bit more time for her to like, you know, show the rest of her fucking booba? Really? No, you. Cuddle, cuddle, cuddly cuddle. This motherfucker just has no shame. It's just immediately just back and forth and back and forth. <laughs> you just sold us out, bro. I don't know. What do we do oh, sure. now? The season's done, I guess. Yeah? You want to take a group picture on the roof? What is it, David? Oh, you got like a plane thing. <laughs> Yogiri actually showing emotion. Yogiri actually showing emotion through his voice acting at the end. Huh? Bye, ninja. Goodbye, Gaijin ninja. Yeah, why, why don't we just send them off? What about us? What is it? What is it? I don't know who's designing these, but like if it's Moku Moku designing these like skin tight suits, it's like, you know what, Moku Moku, you, you might actually be fucking useful. You're very useful, actually. Ride her. Hold on tight to Danora. Where, where are we holding? I mean, this anime started, right? This, this anime started with Danora's titty squishing Yogiri and Yogiri saving her because of the titty squish, right? So we're probably just like ending it just like the same way it started. But it's gotta be you though. You get the ship, you know? Alright, let's see the flight. Danora Arts. Cool, we can just fucking fly like that now. Look at the way he's holding on to her. This is actually fucking hilarious. If you just like look at like the first half of the screen, the left side, just like Danura and Yogiri looks kind of cool. But then you look at like how he's gripping onto her. And it's like a monkey fucking hold on to a fucking branch, bro. Oh, here's the ending playing. I don't know, he'll be fine. I'm sure Hanaka will show up later. Yes, I like Carol. Her name's not Carol, right? It's just I call her Carol because Gaijin, blonde girl. True. We need more Philosopher's Stones then. Her name is actually Carol though? Jesus Christ. Same voice actor too. Is he really sleepy? Or is it just fan service? What the fuck? What is this? Who's in this carriage? Vampire Lolly Lane came back. We finally see her again. But Yogiri probably doesn't know any idea who she is, right? Yeah, who are you? It's anime. I mean, it's in, it's like incest or lolly vampires. You know, they marry me. You know, it's, it always happens. Don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. Yeah. Go I can't. I got down. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Wait, he got instantly rejected. Instant death. Instantly rejected. That's gotta be some kind of wordplay, bro. You Wait, twenty years. Okay, you feed me on her sister. Takadono. Oh? Philosopher's Stone. Another one. Easy. Thank you. Because she was a sage as Lane, right? And I guess I kind of carried over to Risley. She is... She's terrified that Yogiri killed the Dark God, right? But like, don't you realize that like, when you were frozen in time, fighting the Dark God in the seal, he already killed that Dark God too. So this is two Dark Gods we've killed. The first one where you were really close to. So isn't she like really slow right now? What do you mean we cannot ignore a monster but capable of this? If she's talking about Yogiri, that is. What are these things? The, 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 the contractor. The consultant, the consultant. What is that though? Because he was like, those angel Gundams were like fighting fucking the aggressor thing before, but then... I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know. <laughs> Bro's doing so much cardio right now. What are you doing, bro? I can't stand you either. Please don't. Please no harm for him. Please no. Please no. <laughs> no lady is in this other world can resist voting. Now that is a fucking light novel title if I fucking see one, bro. 
We're not done yet? No, we're not done yet? Lap pillow? What are we doing? Got a little bit of the enemy left. If you don't like some guy, I think it's fine to just murder him. Mm, depends on how he perceives not liking somebody. I feel like you should, this is like the worst way to like teach a kid who has the power to instantly kill somebody. Like, how do you... I don't know. I, 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 hot take. I know she means well, but like, this is kind of crazy to just tell the kid, you know? Like, she means good. I know. I know she's a good person, but like that line was kind of crazy. I agree with this line, though. You should think for yourself. Yes, yes, yes. This is also a good line, too. Yes, yes. Wonder if she's still alive. <laughs> Wait, why is Carol like? Risley's upset, but Carol is like nutting just watching this. Does Carol like being cooked? What's she doing? What's she doing? <laughs> she gushing, looking at Yogi, you know, in a lap pillow. And I think that's the episode, guys. Now, uh, this anime series. Uh, listen, like, you, I, I'm sure the light novel is, like, really good, but, like, the pacing, the adaptation of the anime, I honestly tried so fucking hard to keep up with it, but they were going at a pace that was, like, Blitzkrieg, and I honestly think that the anime suffered. Like, I'm sure the light level content, the actual original source material is really good, but the anime kind of just, like, rushed the fuck out of it. I, it was an enjoyable watch, right? I think this is gonna be like a between like a six out of, six six out of like a seven like somewhere between six and seven right out of ten like it was enjoyable it wasn't like the best thing I've ever watched but it was very entertaining it's not like bad it's just that sometimes the plot's rushing like they're cramming like fucking five episodes worth of content in just one so it's like Jesus Christ but hey for what it's worth I think this is a very fun watch it's like nonsensical fun it makes fun of itself there's a lot of for breaking the fourth wall moments and Yogiri just like Shine everything you think it get boring but honestly it just kept getting funnier and funnier to the point where it just became so ridiculous i'm like yep this is gonna die immediately and hey there's even like um future content set up with like the divine king getting mad the angel gundam stuff the philosopher's stone the fact that we can't go back yet i feel like the potential is there they just gotta tone it down just a little bit but still it was a very fun watch for me but hey if you're still here if you enjoyed this reaction please like the video check out the other playlist for more content and until next time take care